Welcome back to Pop Games. Today I want to go ahead and talk about Bungie and Activision split. Oh sh! So we just heard that Activision split with Bungie, which is crazy news for Bungie. That means that they might be able to do a lot of great things this year with Destiny and other titles. Let's go ahead and talk about it right now. The problem with Activision and Bungie is that Activision wanted to release Destiny, new Destiny games every single year, and that put a lot of stress on Bungie. So that's one of the things that may be good for Bungie going forward, is that they are not entitled, they're not constrained to that schedule, which means they may be able to just work on other games, focus on other games that they're working on for the future. However, Bungie will continue working on the Destiny 2 right now. They will continue working on more DLC, more content for that game, and they, will, they said they're gonna continue the game plan for that game moving forward, which means that gamers right now, you're gonna see a lot more content coming for Destiny 2, but nothing's gonna change as uh, Activision splits out from the company. Also, Battle.net is also still hosting Destiny 2 there, so you can still find that there at Battle.net. So Bungie has been working on a new game, and this split from Activision may put more resources towards that new game, more detail for it, and more power, more manpower to uh, work on that game and make it come out sooner than expected. But um, I hope it's a good game. I want to see the difference between that game and Destiny. Activision has some exclusivity when it comes to PS4 uh, and Destiny. Maybe now after this split um, has occurred, maybe uh, Bungie and PlayStation and also Xbox may come up with some kind of agreement to actually be able to play together, play Destiny together, uh, do some crossplay, some kind of stuff like that. I don't see that happening. Uh, the chances of that, I don't know, I'm guessing like 10, 20%, but it might just happen if you know the right people start talking to each other, so this split may be good for that. Let me know in the comments down below if you think that's PlayStation and Xbox will do crossplay when it comes to Destiny, or if you're excited for that. So Phil Spencer went off to Twitter, and I'm summarizing here, he's basically excited about this split as well. He is excited to see what happens with Destiny. He said that Bungie is one of his favorite studios, and Destiny is one of his favorite gaming franchises. So he's excited to see what the future holds for Bungie and Destiny. So what are your thoughts about the split between Activision and Bungie? Do you think it's a good thing for Bungie? Do you think that now it's going to be a more independent studio? It'll have a lot more power, a lot more uh, control over Destiny. And since they're not going to come out with a new Destiny every year, now they can focus on other projects like that new game they're coming out with and also some other games and maybe put out more and better content for Destiny. And I mean that uh, probably uh, Bungie will focus on this one version of Destiny and make it better instead of releasing separate Destinies every single year or years after that. Instead of a Destiny 3, they may just perfect this uh, destiny that they have out now and it would be a good thing for the company so i'm excited to see what happens with that and if you're excited about this split from activision let me know in the comments down below if you're opposed it let me know in the comments down below as well if this video gets 100 likes i will go ahead and post more content like this so please go ahead and like this video share it and if you enjoyed this video please consider subscribing and i'll catch you guys next time good luck bungie